What's up Taurus, hope you're doing well. This is gonna be your three card Monty teaser for love, March 2022. Feel free to like, share, follow, subscribe, reach out for one-on-one -on -one reading as always. Leave your sun, moon, rising sign um, below in the comment section. Um, share with friends, family, peers, coworkers, people that you think might be interested in the content value and or one-on-one -on -one reading. All my links are below to the website, to the Patreon. The Patreon will have the meat and potatoes of this reading. Remember, this is just going to be Taurus, a love March 2022 teaser. We're going to pick up where we left off with the Patreon link below. So get the second half to this reading there. Um, hope you guys are doing well. Spirit of gratitude, joy, love, and light has possible messages at this time for Taurus. Had a lot of great, awesome energy and reading so far with the All Signs and with Aries. Please, please, please check them out. The teasers are on the YouTube. Uh, Spirit of gratitude, joy, love, and light has possible messages for Taurus. Cross watchers are welcome here. Um, Taurus represents the second house in astrology, which we all have, so feel free to apply this to your day-to-day, um, -day, how you generate income, um, that aspect of your life, um, uh, as well as materialisms and all that stuff. But for the most part, this is going to be for love uh, and um, March 2022. Spirit of gratitude, joy, love, and light. Highest possible messages for three card Monty teaser for Taurus and or second house energies. Okay. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Awesome and amazing energy. First and foremost, we have the Ten of Cups in the upright here. Um, doing a live stream simulcast on the YouTube running Ontario. Check that out as well. See how the fudge is made. Um, Pisces energy. So within this Pisces season is what I'm getting here. March 19th is when we leave Pisces energy. Um, high watermark with the Ten of Cups in the upright here, uh, Taurus. This is being able to reach a peak emotionally, the height of your powers. Um, I'm getting that this Ten of Cups is on a solid foundational... Um, stance which you're bringing to the table uh, because you can only get the 10 when you've gone through the 9 and the 9 represents emotional independence being able to stand on your own two feet emotionally not being able to be manipulated persuaded or knocked off the hinges the king of pentacles is here aries taurus energy read him and weep in and of itself right here so very interesting because when we were around the all signs aries type energy we believe to have had i believe to have had I believe we had, I should say, the King of Pentacles in reverse, meaning somebody was gearing up, someone was realizing their worth or self-value. That's where all worth and value comes from, it comes from the self. It doesn't come from externalized input or, or insight or anything like that. It comes as a direct result of what value are you bringing to the table in regards to momentum, in regards to adding value to people's lives, etc., etc. So this realization of holy shit i am the king of pentacles comes from within this turns over the dial turns over and now you're in full force full bloom this ten of pen this ten of cups in the upright if you're not seeing this as an externalized version of relationship happiness family as a result of in the external third dimensional realm this could be a unification of divine masculine feminine energies within the self infant child vulnerable self the divine kind of triad trinity there. The Knight of Wands on and rushing. Someone or something is on and rushing to you. I have an inkling, I have a notion of what this is, but again, this is the Card Monty teaser for Taurus. Let's follow up with that on the Patreon. Link below to get the, um, the, 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 the extent to this reading. Um, and yeah, let's do that now. Okay, so Patreon link below. Let's let's do it, guys. This is very exciting. Um, let's see what we have to uh, say about this Knight of Wands in the upright. What's up to the viewer on the YouTube live stream?